Welcome, in front of me is a Samsung Galaxy Tab S10 Plus and today I will show you how you can hard reset this device through settings. So to get started you will want to open up your settings application. Here you will need to scroll all the way down to general management and swipe down again on this side and you will find reset options. Scrolling down you will find factory data reset as the last option. You want to click on that and this will present you with the data that will be removed by this process, which most importantly will include things like music, photos, and all user data. If you have anything uh, like this that you'd like to keep or anything else that is listed right here that you'd like to preserve, make a copy of it before you go any further. Now you can do a backup of your device using the Samsung, uh, like Samsung backup, whatever they have. Uh, don't remember what it was called, uh, something smart. Uh, but because it's called something smart, you can expect that it's not going to be smart. And uh, I will point that out right now if you're planning to utilize that, because maybe you're getting rid of this tablet. Um, then make sure that if you want to restore that backup, whatever your next device that you will be restoring it to is a Samsung. Otherwise, this backup becomes unavailable to you. So something to keep in mind when you're doing the backup with the Samsung crap and uh, their own application, this will only allow you then to restore it to another Samsung and nothing else. Kind of limiting. And additionally, at least from my experience when I was using a Fold 4, Samsung was an absolute uh, nightmare to, to back up my data manually using a cable as it would pr constantly disconnect for no effing reason. Uh, so magically the samsung garbage worked on pc but manually backing it up it would always disconnect and just try to screw me over it just seems like a deliberate uh deliberate way to just make sure that you will use their dog shit so when you want to restore it your another phone needs to be also a samsung which is a uh, absolutely dog shit scammy way of just doing things so anyway with that out of the way uh, at the bottom, you'll find a reset button. Click on that. Now, before you see this delete all option, you will be forced by for most of you to sign out of your Samsung account. Uh, and once you actually first, you will be probably forced to confirm your screen lock. And then it will tell you to also sign out of the account, uh, which defeats the purpose of showing you the freaking screen lock if you still need to sign out of the account. So just show one, don't waste people's time. Uh, so yeah, uh, if it seems like it's pointless, that's because it is. Um, in any case, once you confirm the, both of those, assuming you have both of those, you can then select delete all, and this will then begin factory resetting the device. The reason that none of that showed up for me is because there is no Samsung account on here and there is no screen lock on here. So the device just automatically goes to shutting it down, deleting the data, and then uh, resetting itself, which will take a couple minutes to finish up. And once it's completed, we will be presented with Android setup screen. So I'll be back once that is visible for me. Uh, the reset is now finished, though it's popping me up with a pin as I have a SIM card. So I'm just gonna quickly eject that. There we go. And there we go. The reset is now finished and you can set up your tablet however you like. So, with that being said, if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.